Hey guys, I'm back again today with another video. Today I'm going to be showing y'all how to make this GMC grill right here. This is my newest GMC. I just got it last night. And it's huge. I love it though. And it's very beautiful. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to show y'all how to make the grill like I do. It, it's pretty simple. Just go ahead and buy yourself a new body. Just a plain new body. You want to choose a dark color because the grill is going to be a glossy white or a glossy light gray and it's going to blend too well with very light colors so you want to go ahead and pick yourself a medium to dark color and uh make sure you have at least 100 gold because you're going to need to buy a decal pack but anyway you want to go ahead and get this sharp looking square right here make sure you hit this button up here right here to make it go on both sides and you want to just line that up with the headlights uh good thing is like the new bodies have like a little place right here where you can see like the body panels i'm gonna be going in and out like that a lot because y'all know how game crashes when uh you do decals so that's the best way to prevent that so anyway we're gonna go ahead and mm -hmm. we're gonna go ahead and uh just stretch that across there just like that uh, if you want, you can go ahead and put a chrome bumper. If you want, like, you can just take one of these big decals, uh, size it down, and make it go on both sides to make, like, a chrome bumper just like that. But today, we're not going to be doing a chrome bumper, so you want to go ahead and get this little piece right here, and you want to you wanna match it with uh, the... You, hold on. I'm struggling here, guys. I haven't done it in a while. I'm going to go ahead and match it. Uh, and we're going to have to take, like, a little circle or something, match it to the body. And then you want to go ahead and place it on both sides. And let's just clean this up a little. And there we go. We got our chrome grill put in right now. Um, you want to go ahead and go to lines we'll buy that decal pack go ahead and go to lines i like to make mine like plain black or either match it to the gray that's in the back of the grill you want to go ahead and stretch that across and uh you want to go ahead and make it go on to both sides see how i'm doing right here and there you go you got your line then you want to go back just duplicate one of these little chrome panels you got and you want to size it down a little and see those like grill inserts in the back those little the two black ones in the middle you want to line it up with that kind of so you can put your gmc logo in there we'll go ahead and put gmc we're just going to do it the red oh, they mean to click the white we're going to do it the red and i used to do this font but now i prefer this font for doing it and I like to move the red down just a little and then darken it just like that. And that kind of gives you like the perfect GMC red in my opinion. You can color match it though if you want, but we're not going to be doing that. We're going to do the red. And that's your GMC grill right there, guys. Like I said, you can do a chrome uh, bumper if you want. It's all up to you. Uh... Chrome bumper's nice. Let's let's try it. We should try it, I guess. There we go. Yeah, that looks uh fancy, I guess you could say. Then uh for other decals you can just put on the mirrors, you can put like little chrome uh mirror covers on it. Like you can put them right there to do the bottom, which is what I like to do, or you can just put it on the top part instead because some people prefer this be honest i'm more of like a bottom person for the mirror chrome and then you can either slap on sierra or denali badges for the side of it just size them down uh just don't do the thing where it goes on both sides because writing if you write any letters it comes out like uh it comes out backwards so you want to like go ahead and just duplicate this and put it on the other side when you do it. 
just like this. Uh, some other decals you can do. I like to sometimes do a little Z71 right up here. Like, uh, cause some people would take like Z71 badges after marking and like put them right here or I'm not sure if they come on them or not. I'm not really sure. All right. We need to put that a little bigger right there. But yeah, you can put it like that if you want. Or you can go ahead and make your Z71 off-road. Go ahead and make your red Z. Choose your font. Uh, then you just take a 71. Make that white. And that's the best way. You use so many decals on a new body. I recommend like just doing the z71 really plain like don't put like off-road under it or any of that i mean if you have more decals than 20 you can but a lot of time <laughs> excuse me a lot of times when you fully build a gmc you run out of decals fast like uh well, I'll, I'll go ahead and fully build this one we're gonna go ahead and put the badge in the back it's gonna be a s l t make that badge white Size it down. There we go. And then we're going to go ahead and duplicate our Sierra. And there we go. Dang, I thought I used a lot more decals than I do. But then again, I didn't put the Z71. We're going to go ahead and just make that one full color. We're going to make that like just a white Z71 badge. And we're just going to put that on the top of the fender just like that and duplicate it and put it on the other side. Let's see, you can go ahead and make an eye and then make that eye red, make it matte, and you can just like make it into the circular font. See this little round font right here? Just make it like whatever color you want and we can make a third brake light. Uh, here we go. There, now you got a little third brake light, but you have, you've used 16 of your decals. Um, if you want to do anything else, you can do like, uh, I'm trying to think. I wonder if, I've, I've tried doing that GMC tailgate before, but it didn't really turn out the best, but we're going to try it again. So let's go ahead. And try to make this. Let's see. Let's try using this eye. And we're going to duplicate it on the both sides. We're going to go ahead and move our GMC logo up a little. Or is it under the thing? I'm, I'm sorry, y'all. I really don't know. I think it's under the thing. But then, anyway, we're going to go ahead and um, we're going to get this little L shape right here. Make that matte black. And then we are going to curve it around the side. And duplicate it. Let's see. Then we're going to go ahead and take another eye. Make sure it's like uh, duplicated. And I guess that will work as a little GMC tailgate. I mean it didn't come out the best. But if y'all want to try it. Like, it's all right. I'll improve my craft later because, uh, like I like I said, I, I usually don't try the GMC on tailgates. Like, I usually just do this little design. That's why I prefer. Um, there my Z71 is. Sierra, C Z71 up there, mirror chrome. Here's my grill. Nothing fancy. Color match bumper. That's why I usually prefer in my GMCs, and uh, I didn't even mean to hit that. And if you come over here, uh, this is my other grill. I can show y'all how to do this one next time, but this one's going to take a little time because it's a little more complicated than just putting a line in the grill. But yeah, uh, this is the little GMC, and I hope this helps y'all out. Let's go ahead and throw some wheels on here. We're just going to throw some reps on here, tell y'all the truth because 
I don't want to go super fancy in case I didn't, I uh, don't save this build. Let's see, let's, should we throw flakes on here? We could throw flakes on here. Hmm. I don't know why it feels weird. Let's let's just give that like a baby lean. And there we go. We have our GMC. I hope y'all enjoyed. I hope this video helped. And uh can we can we try for ten likes on the video? Um and thank y'all for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one.